today in our kitchen we have generation 3 onboard charger uh, same device is used in model s from 2016 to 2021 and same for model x and this onboard charger is used uh, for supercharger v3 150 kilowatts uh, kilowatts a uh, few of them i think 12 or 14 pieces is stuck inside the charging station and is used to supercharge the cars uh, it's three phase 17 kilowatts uh, power device and it has three phases in this case three two of them are uh, fail completely uh, fuses are blown 40 amps and there is short short circuit inside of phase one and phase three uh, only working phase is phase two and uh, on the model s and model x if first phase is in defect obc doesn't work uh, first phase always must be in working condition uh, two and three can fail and the obc onboard charger can work without number two and number three but first one must be in working condition now we will check phase one yeah we have short circuit and phase three between a line and the ground this is same issue with short circuit i think protection diode is in defect the second yeah it is we need to the solder complete board all those points this 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 all fats all diodes uh, uh, control connector this is output 400 volts dc everything must be desoldered first we must preheat complete the piece obc and then the solar the complete board this is three to four hours job just for one phase board let's start I freed this part of the board. Pin is cleaned. And now I will try to lift just this side of the board. Okay, it's freed. And I will try just to take out this part. It will be a little bit complicated. But it's possible. Yeah, see it's wheels. Yeah, we use our new one from Mauser. And it will be a little bit tricky to put it back on those spots here and here. But let's try. new IGBTs, I mean uh, protective diode, diodes are in and phase one is finished now I need to solder it, put all the screws back and start phase two
Phase 3 board is already finished. I skipped the part where I changed the protection diodes and uh, because it seemed like only one. L3 is done. Now we can push the board down to see if all the pins fit inside. If not, yeah, it's okay. Everything fits. Now I will solder the uh, pins and assemble it back. It's ready for delivery. All those Gen 3 OBC charges for Model S and Model X from 2016 to 2021. They usually do not have any issues with the AC or DC side by its own. Those issues are usually triggered by outside uh, issue. For example, if you charge on the same AC charger with another car, and if that car is, for example, BMW hybrid, it with, with the defect OBC, if it triggers so short circuit on the BMW side, uh, it could burn the fuses on your AC side. And not only the fuses, it damages the protect, protect, uh, protection diodes. And uh, you, don't, you, don't not, you don't even know what is the reason of the defect, but it's usually the external occurrence. Uh, for all customers from outside uh, from outside Croatia, we have ready. This is, for example, ready repaired, refurbished uh, OBC in Tesla. It costs 1,600 euros, something like that. And we exchange the part with the customer. Customer send us a defect one, and the same day we send the new one, refurbished one, to the customer. In that case, it's only needed to make the redeploy on MCU software, or if customer can wait, we can repair his OBC, of course, if it's possible, and that's it. See you guys.